God, help me! Help me! Help me! <laughs> We get roofied in Nashville. Yeah, cause baby, Ella was saying that we would not survive if we got roofied and I had to take care of us. No, if I got roofied and she had to take care of me, that would be it. I'd be taken, I'd be kidnapped, Alex no. would be laying on the street cause someone flicked her forehead. No. Now if Alex- Good morning everybody. Welcome back to my channel for another video. <laughs> Y'all, today the boys and I are going to the library for the first time. I am taking them to the library. Yes, you guys, my babies. Cause Gabe wants to go and rent some books and I want, you know, I want to make sure I'm fostering this love of reading, reading he has. But Bo Chow, we're going to pray for him. We don't know, y'all only got one lash on. The other one is coming off, child. I fell in this bed last night and I went to bed. <laughs> you hear me? So I'm about to get up out the bed and get the boys ready because the library opens at 10. And then I promised them we would go shopping for shoes because they really want some new shoes, child. And then I'll probably take them by Born to Noble to meet Sister Christy. So, yeah. I don't know. We'll see. But okay, guys. I will be back looking like somebody's mama. Because mm -hmm. I am. Because I am. Okay, guys. We are all ready. You got Bobo right there. And then Gabe is right Yay! there. First stop, y'all, we are going to the library. Well, really? We are going to the library um, to go get the Too boys. Careful. To go get the boys' library cards. And then we're going to go head up to Fairview Heights because we're going to go shoe shopping because they really want some new shoes. And which Gabe doesn't even need any new shoes. He has plenty, but it's fine. And then I'm going to make sure we go by the bookstore so Sister Christy can meet the boys. Hopefully, she's still there by the time we get there. Hopefully, we're out of here really soon. But okay, guys, I will pull you out when we get to Walmart. I mean, when we get to Walmart. When we get to the library. I said this is going to be my first time it's being It's going to be my first time. Bo, let him talk. It's going to be my first time being to an actual library that's not in the school. Not yeah. My life, yeah. As y'all can see, Bo is, Bo is y'all, this gonna be, y'all, I pray that we get to vlog the whole day because dealing with Bo is a lot. A lot. A lot. Bobo, Bobo done found a toy's giant to the notebook. Oh, what's that? That's here. 
heads here. Are you writing a book? To, are you gonna write a book today? Hmm? <laughs> We're thinking that Dave Pilkey is Gabe's favorite author because he writes a lot of the graphic novels that Gabe enjoys reading. He's looking for it's called Dumb Bunnies right now. We can't find it. found a book, my lord. Where he got it from, I have no clue. Be gentle. Be gentle. Hey guys, we just finished at the library. Show them what books you got, guys, before I buckle up. Buckle up. Big Nate. <laughs> He's trying to show y'all. This is the book Bubble got. It is uh, Middle West, book two by Scotty Young and George Corona. That's the book Bubble got. And the book Gabe got is Big Nate Ola. Is it stuck to it? 
It is. You can't even see the cover. It's I guess they take it off whenever you bring it back. What is it called? Big Nate? Ola. Ola by Lincoln Pierce. Yeah. Aloha. It's, Big it's, Nate Aloha. It's a receipt. Yeah, it's a receipt, but it's sticky, so it stays on until we bring it back. Well, okay, guys, we're about to go to Barnes & Noble first, so I can let Gabe find the books that he's looking for. What is it called? Rabbit what? Um, dumb bunnies. Dumb, dumb bunnies. <laughs> and then, so they can say, hi, this is Christy, and then we're going to go shoe shopping, right? Mm -hmm. All right, we'll see you guys when we get to Barnes & Noble. We just saw Sister Christy, but she was so busy that she couldn't talk right now. They are like, she's working in a cafe, child. And she don't even work in the cafe. So that should tell you how busy they are. So yes, I'm gonna take the boys to the book section. Gabe already found the book. I'm gonna see if he can find another book. And then I'll show you guys when we get up out of here. Yeah. Yeah. He is not getting no free books. We pay for these books. Y'all, that was the fastest visit to Barnes & Noble I've ever experienced. One, boy, Bo was complaining the whole time talking about something. He ready to get to the car to eat his cookie. Bo, show me a cookie. All right, I'm here, cookie, too. Okay, I'm going to show you the cookie. The cookie is smelling good. See, smell it. They can't smell it. Uh, smell it. Let's show him it's a turtle. Let's see. It's a turtle. It's it's a real turtle. A very overpriced cookie. And then Gabe actually got a book. Gabe's gonna show him what book you got. And Gabe got a uh, cookie too. Well, Gabe's gonna show him. Get up and show them the book. This is why I'm bringing my kids to born. They were both ready to go. Gabe got. We got a family by LeBron James and Andrea Williams. Because he loves LeBron James and I don't know why. I like a brown shade. You do? Uh-huh. What's wrong with LeBron James? Oh, this cookie James? good. <laughs> Getting a cookie was a good idea. What's wrong with LeBron James, Mom? I don't know. I don't know what it is. Something different. Something a little different. But that was literally the fastest I have ever been in. I but we went back and talked to Sister Chris for a little bit. I didn't put my camera out because we were just talking. Mm -hmm. And it was funny because she was talking to Bo and Bo. Both started screaming, stranger danger, stranger danger. I don't know why he says that all the time now. Bo, is that your new thing? Mm -hmm. Huh? Mm -hmm. Bo, stand up and tell the people about yourself. I don't, a lot stranger of danger! Okay. A lot of y'all, this, um, this is my youngest. I'll let my oldest talk in a minute. That's my youngest, Bo. Child, Bo, talk to him. Tell him how old you are. Bo, I, Bo. Hi. Bo. What's up, guys? How old are you? 500. Okay, what do you like to do for fun? <laughs> Bo, how? <laughs> Bo, you ate the head of the cookie. Mm -hmm. The turtle head gone. Mm -hmm. Let me see. See, guys. Yeah, look at the turtle's head. It's gone. It's gone. Gabe, you want to talk to the people or not yet? I'm bleeding. Huh? I'm bleeding. Let me see. Bo, you going to let your brother talk? Yeah. Hold up a second. Look at my merch hoodie. Never, this is not my merch. What? You ain't got no merch. What are you talking about? Some of them look at my merch. Because I got a lot of feels. You got a lot of videos? On my tablet. On your tablet? Oh, you got videos on your tablet. Mm -hmm. But you ain't posting them. So that means they're not on YouTube, which means you don't got no merch. Oh, yeah. How do you do that? <laughs> you edit them and then you upload them. You show me? I could. No, because. No, you're not putting videos on YouTube. I don't trust you. But I want to feel. I know, but I don't trust you. But I trust myself. You trust? Oh, I'm so proud of you. I'm so happy that you trust yourself. Mommy don't trust you because you're five. 
I mean, you do a lot of questionable things. Yes, I do. Hmm? Yes, I do. Hmm. Stranger danger. <laughs> That's exactly one with your snotty nose. Okay, sit down and let your brother. Okay, guys. Anyways, um, the, I ended the vlog. I didn't show y'all me going with Serenity, y'all. I ended up taking myself on a date right here. Make sure you follow my Instagram. I'm going to cover Ella's face and put my Instagram. Go follow me on Instagram and watch my little solo date I just went on. So, you guys, you haven't seen Ella in a while. All of you newbies here, this is Ella. This is my bestie, boo-boo. Hi. <laughs> she does her little small features every once in a while. But y'all going to see her heavy when we go to Nashville because we go to Nashville real soon. Mm -hmm. So, be on the lookout for the videos because they're going to be on and popping. Um, so, <laughs> so, Ella is going to tell you guys about Haunting Adeline because, y'all, I... I didn't read that. The Lord told me to stop reading it. And then this devil picked it up and loved it. She ate the book up. She, I would probably say she ate it within like, uh, she ate it. She read it within like two days. I would say if you didn't have to stop. Yeah. You probably got it done within like two days. Yeah. Like, and that book, do you have it on you? It's in the car. That book is thick. It's like almost 600 pages. Like me. <laughs> um, okay, she's going to give y'all a review. But I told her to be careful with the spoilers. Sorry. And don't, why is she trying to kick me off on my TV show? Oh, <laughs> I told her to be careful with the spoilers and don't tell you guys everything. Okay. Okay. Um, where to I start? You just, okay. Okay, so. So what did you rate the book? Um, out of 10. No, out of five. Out of five, I'd give it a three and a half. That's it? I mean, you I, didn't like it. No, I did really like it. Not that you didn't like it, but you didn't really. But mm. there was parts in it that I was just like, mm. Oh, okay. I thought mm -hmm. you enjoyed it a little more than that. No, I re I did really enjoy it, but then I also got peed off at the ending. Oh. Mm, yeah. Okay. And then there's just some things that I just was like, ew. Too mm -hmm. much. It was too much for me. Um, I like the book because it had like three different like storylines. Like, I can't explain it, but <laughs> <laughs> it had like a bunch of different like little things you had to like, you had to read to the end to like figure out. Except for one of them didn't finish. You have to read the second book to figure it out. Did you order it last night? I did. <laughs> she ordered the second one, y'all, because I don't have the second one. But she ordered it. I'm trying to get her to come to book club with me on the 19th. But she acts like, mm, but she loves smut. So I think, girl, you can make time. We make time for what we want to make time for. <laughs> I'm busy, too. <laughs> Real busy. When's the 19th? That's today. No, that's April, girl. Oh. You don't even, you don't got nothing planned for April 19th. Mm-mm. Your April calendar was open. I don't know why she be acting like she this and she got to do this or do that. She can pick and choose what she actually really wants to do. And I think that she would enjoy book club. Um, yeah, well. Read Anyways, <laughs> that's all you got to say about Hunting Adeline. Who was your um, favorite character? My favorite character? Zayd. He sounded hot. So you liked him? Even yeah. though he, wasn't he the most toxic of all of the characters? Yes. He's got something wrong with him. What do you guys know about her trauma? <laughs> no, like he did he did some weird stuff. I'm not gonna cuss. Um the character that got on my nerves the most probably was Addie. Is that her name? Yeah. It's always it's always the main characters. Like right now I'm reading I'm on liar for I want you to read hate so bad. Hate? But, well, I don't know what the series is called, the Tate James series by that I'm reading the hate. I read hate and now oh. liar. The main character What's her name? Madison Kate. She's, she's so annoying. Yeah, like... It's just so annoying. You're talking about how much you hate them, but then you're like... You're not showing them. No! You hate them. They're so freaking annoying. But yes. Like, oh just get over it, y'all. Mm -hmm. Get together. Get, do what y'all gotta do so we can move on with our lives. Mm -hmm. And into the next book. The longer you take to do what you gotta do, the longer it's gonna take me to finish this book. I don't know a review without like giving spoilers like, I'm it's really, so hard i'm really trying but i feel like i got nothing to say because i don't want to spoil anything yeah and you could really i wish you had the book because you could really just read the back of the book and go off of that that's what i normally oh do God. because the back of the book tells you i'll get stage right here i can <laughs> she says she will get stage. that's good enough they they it's fine hello I was going to pull it up on Goodreads and read the back of it through there. Oh, she's going to pull up on Goodreads for you guys. She Oh, also, Ella has Goodreads now. I do. I will put her Goodreads across the screen, so I need you to text it to me. Or no, I will actually put it in my description box. So go follow Ella on Goodreads because she's trying to start reading again, guys, because Ella's been a little stressed. <laughs> and I think, that, I don't think she realized, she already, she always enjoyed reading. I don't think she realized how much it is an escapism from your reality. 
because she ate that book up. That's yeah. a thick book. And someone that does not read like Avidly, that's for her to finish that that fast, that shows you how stressed she was. <laughs> okay, actually, you wanna know what? I'm gonna give the book a four. I changed my mind because okay. I did actually really like it. See, you can do that. We're allowed to change our mind. Yeah. I change it to a four. Do I have to read this? No, you can just read what you want, like what you certain parts that stood out to you. Um Hold on, child sugarfoot. Hello? Hello? What to do whenever And we're back. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Really none of this kind of goes with the book, I don't think. Like he didn't you didn't read it. Well, I'm not going to read it. Okay. Hold on. Well, you want to know what I'm. Oh, okay. okay. We're back. <laughs> okay, we're back. Um, yeah, I changed my mind. I'm gonna give the book a four. Um, if you like smut, yeah, definitely read it. Some things were a little intense for me though. Not really the smut part. Well, some of the smut part was, but like some of the. Yeah. Like torture parts. Like he was like, yeah. I didn't need to read that. It was kind of scary. So it kind of was like, so it really was dark romance. It was dark. Yeah. He did mm. some, yeah. I mean, oh. <laughs> Y'all really shouldn't enjoy dark romance as much as I do because I'm really innocent. Right? Right. When right. I say, when you read it, Zade sounds fine. He do. You should show them how they drew Zade or whatever you looked up. Y'all, excuse my lashes, they throwing up gang signs. Um, I was going to say, me and Ella... Wanna, we're gonna do a Q&A for you guys when we're in, um, when we're in, what's it called? Nashville. So drop your questions down below because we're gonna film it. And we just came up on our friendship anniversary. Can y'all believe me and LF only known each other for a year? It seems like a lot longer, doesn't it? Yeah, it's most of She really gets on my nerves most days, but she's, no. tol she's tolerable. <laughs> no, Alex gets on my nerves most days. Well, I don't know if you can see it. Yeah, they can see it. Get close to there. Mm. I mean, he's just fine. <laughs> oh Addy, my god. Addy was, yeah. Is that all you gonna tell him? I don't know how to like, I don't know what I can and can't say. Well, if it's something bad, I'll just edit it out. Okay. That's um, the power of editing. <laughs> there's like three storylines in. It's like you got to solve a murder. You find out like if they're gonna be in love or not. And you find out like if Zade's job is gonna interfere or not. But let me tell you, one of those, you gotta wait till the next book. Man, that made me mad last night. I was so mad. Okay, so guys, how did Ella do with her first book review? So do you plan on reading the second one? Yeah, I bought it. It'll be here Thursday. Oh, so you're gonna start it. You got mm -hmm. plans this weekend? I know you yeah. say you're not doing it on Friday, though. No, no, I am. Oh, you are? I was going to say maybe she'll have it read by next week and we could do another review. I was just Liam's Valentine's cancer. That's why you said you wanted Twisted Love read by Thursday. Mm -hmm. Because, <laughs> y'all, she's about to read Twisted Love. Oh, my God, I still haven't done my video on the whole series. But she's about to start Twisted Love today. Yeah. And she's like, I got to have it done by Thursday. And I didn't know that's why she said that. Because hunting, hunting Adeline comes in. On Thursday. So the first one is haunting Adeline. The second one is hunting Adeline. Although when I read it on Goodreads, it did say that it was worse. It yeah. kind of sucked. Yeah. That's but you might of, like it. Yeah. That's why I don't really like looking at other people's reviews for stuff. Because like, even with the Dreamland Billionaire series, everybody's favorite one was um, the second one with Iris and Declan. But my favorite one was the last one with um, Cal and uh, what's her name? Alana. So I, I think it goes off of your life experiences and what you can resonate with more with each book. But are we going to end the video here? Ella, we've been talking for 10 minutes. So we've been doing good? That's fan freaking we got to cut out like five minutes of this. No, I don't have to cut out one minute. Me and Rashonda were on the phone for like one minute. Oh. Um, yeah, that's all I feel like I could really say. Can't spoil it. Are you excited for Nashville? I'm super excited for Nashville. What are you most excited about for Nashville? Um... That one store that we had seen. The cereal one. The vintage. Oh, the one a spoon? Yeah, and I don't even like milk or cereal that much. So. Oh, has anybody ever been to one a spoon in Nashville? If you have, comment down below and let us know if we should go. And we're going to, it's, I think it's called Novelette. It's a bookstore. Oh, and we're going one. to 
McKay's. It's a huge used bookstore. And then we're going to that vintage. You still want to go to that vintage yeah, store? Yeah, I really want to go to this vintage store. Yeah, we're about to be tourists in the city. And we're going to a record store. And I'm so excited. Yes. And we're going to find. Oh, yeah. Give us all the good food wrecks down below. Yes. Send us good. Because we want to spend some money on food. Mm -hmm. That's the main thing we want to buy. It's good food. Because one thing we like to do. Is eat. Is eat. And we're not going to go out. No, we're not going out. We're staying at the Airbnb and then we're going to see the sights. Yes, because we're going to be good. I'm always good. This hussy, she low-key alcoholic. No. <laughs> I just don't want to get roofied in Nashville. Yeah, because baby, Ella was saying that we would not survive if we got roofied and I had to take care of us. No, if I got roofied and she had to take care of me, that would be it. I'd be taken. I'd be kidnapped. Alex no. would be laying on the street because someone flicked her forehead. No. Now, if Alex got roofied, Everything would be fine. If we would be handled, I could get us out of there. We would be alive. Not the other way around. No, so, I, I really feel like no. people do not give me enough credit. I'm a boyfriend. It's like I'm just this fragile piece of whatever. I can, I can, I can fight. See? Did they see that? That's what I thought. Shut up. Get off of her. <laughs> Exactly. If Alex was roofied, we would be okay. Um, if I was roofied, we would not be okay because your hands are dainty. No, they're not. They are very dainty. I do not do hard work with my hands. I'm a lady. But like, if you are a lady and you do hard work, that's your business. Mm. If I was getting kidnapped, this would be Alex. Stop. Let her go. No. Especially if it was a final white man. That's it. No, she did Cut not. No, I'm keeping it in. No, she didn't say if it was a fine old white man. Yo, I don't know why. You would tell him to take you too. We would both get kidnapped. I would be like, don't forget about me. Exactly. <laughs> I'd be like, Alex, stop. No, for real. I really think I do good. That's what I thought. Shut up. Say it again to her. Bop. You do it. Bop. Bop. Oh, wow, you're good. Really? Yeah. Bop. I think we're being delusional. <laughs> people you just gotta go pop, pop. i don't hit people i fall down and cover my face i am too beautiful to be fighting anybody i ain't got eyes i'm not doing that if i'll I call the fight. police no if i have to fight i'll fight but i'm not gonna i'm not fighting unless you touch my kids or something happen with my children then i'm fighting you but i'm picking something up i'm not using my hands exactly They're too i'm precious. pulling hair i'm throwing shit yeah i'm definitely gonna go kung fu panda on you mm-hmm but I, I don't know how good of a kung fu panda would be because I, I can't fight. So I just go for the eyes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so maybe it is a good idea if we don't yeah. go anywhere or, you know, because she got roofied. I told her, I'll call your mom. What else am I supposed What's to do? What's mom going to do? Get there in two seconds? She's four hours away. Yeah, but. I'm gone. No, I would. I think, okay, so. Someone's done bought me and I've done business. Okay, okay, so we're about to reenact it. So somebody's okay. like talking to you and they got you. Okay, I just. Oh, freak! What the heck? What do I do? <laughs> she passed out. Oh my God, okay. Stop. No, no, I'm already dead. They no. already came and taken me, Alex. This is taking too long. <laughs> you go. Okay, okay. Okay. Oh my God, help me! Help me! <laughs> you did exactly what I did. I grabbed you. You let me lay here. Okay, okay, okay. Let me do it over. Let me do it over. Let me do it over. It's okay. Help us! No, you can't have her. Pop, pop, pop. You can't have her. Pop, pop, pop. Okay, now imagine, imagine it's like a middle-aged white man. That's fine. Like I would have killed it though. Pop, pop, pop. No, I would have taken a beer bottle, broke it, and I just would have been like this. If anyone tried to come near you, you were good. Ella's a little. I'd stab him. What's the word that is not offensive? <laughs> just say it. What's the offensive word? You're gonna I say? can't even say it, y'all. I ain't trying to have none of my new little friends on here. My little book friends. I don't want y'all mad at me. But okay, guys. Dang, we've been talking for 15 minutes. Ooh. Wow. Content. Hashtag content. Okay, guys, I guess we'll end it here, and I will see you guys on Sunday. I'm pretty sure I got some plans this weekend. I do. 
I do have really good plans this weekend, but I don't know if you'll see that till next Wednesday. I might film something else for Sunday. But okay, we'll see you on Sunday. Okay, bye. <laughs>